Hi, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be comparing these two Moise Night watches from Harlem Bling. They are both pretty expensive, over a thousand dollars each. So yeah, let's get into the comparison. One is rose gold and has a skeleton face. The other one it has a perpetual calendar and is made of straight stainless steel with no plating. So let's get into it. First things first, I'm going to tell you guys about the stainless steel one. This one has a blue face with a perpetual calendar and it runs you $1,500 before any discount codes. But you can go ahead and use mine, save 10% off if there's no watch codes going on. Here you go right here. You got the rose gold one and I will show you guys the up close later. This one is gonna run you about $1,400 and there's Roman numerals around, which I think look really cool. But yeah, the plating is pretty good as well and both have the same amount of carrots of moissanite. 35 carats each so here is both watches side by side as you can see man super super shiny and both are really cool looking here you got the blue face and you can see the three calendars you got the day month as well you got the time and the date a lot of different things there you got four different things very useful this one you can see all the gears inside which i think look really cool but yeah you don't get as many things to look at but instead you get the skeleton face i haven't moved the watch enough it's not winded so it's not moving but yeah i would say the shine is pretty comparable on both as well though in the sunlight I would say maybe the rose gold one might hit a little better. I'm not sure why. Just something about it being behind the rose gold plating. But if anything, they're pretty even. Both crowns are the same. No difference in that. The quality is pretty even on these too. This is the top quality that Harlem Bling has. This is the highest ones, most expensive watches they have on their website. They're pretty cool, man. Yeah. They're both very heavy, but comment which one you like better. I'm pretty split decision, but there you go. We can get the weight of each for you guys. The rose gold skeleton, 167 grams. hundred seventy six. So this one is a little heavier. But here's a better up close of the blue one for you. Both watches are as well 42 millimeters, just so you know. And they both have sapphire clear crystal on the glass. Go check out my full review of each. The link will be in the description if you guys are interested. Try to go into more detail about each and I'll show you guys much better angles of them. Here you go. Not bad up close, man. Here we got the rose gold one up close. Super pretty. I love looking at those gears move. It's just so satisfying. There you go. The Roman numerals as well are pretty cool, pretty unique. This watch isn't like a ripoff of any watch. It's not inspired by anything. It's like Harlem Bling's original design, which is something I really like about this one. But yeah, look at all those moving parts inside. Super, super cool. <laughs> Oof. All those moving parts inside, yeah. Super cool, man. There you go. As well, both are super shiny and both have a honeycomb set for the stones on the wrist. It's not a standard setting. This is a honeycomb setting, just so you know. That'll be it for today's video. I hope you enjoy my comparison of both of these watches. If you like either of them and want to see more details about each, go ahead and check my reviews out for both of them. The link will be down below. But yeah, if you guys go one last look, please remember to like, sub, and comment. I will be posting more reviews and more comparison videos for y'all. But see you on the next one. Peace.